Good Monday afternoon, everybody. I'm meteorologist John Gerard here in CBS4 Weather Control. The weather looks really nice out there to kick off this new work week here in South Florida. Just a few scattered clouds drifting in off that uh, southeasterly breeze today. But we are tracking our next weather system. It's now, now moving through the Tennessee Valley on down toward the Gulf Coast, back toward eastern Texas, an area of low pressure going to be causing quite a bit of rain over the deep south up toward the mid-Atlantic states in the next uh, couple of days. Maybe some snow on the western fringes of that, but primarily a very heavy rain producer for a good portion of the eastern U.S. in the next few days. That's a system that will uh, push a cold front into south Florida on Wednesday, getting us our best chance of rain this week. In the meantime, mostly sunny, warm, and breezy out there this afternoon. Temperature is getting up to about 81. Southeast on the winds at 10 to 20. Watch out for rip currents out of the beach if you're heading down that way this afternoon. A little bit bumpy for the boaters. No advisories, but still running about 2 to 5 feet on the seas. The bay water is a moderate chop. Surf temperature a cool 71. And those winds 10 to 15 knots, mainly out of the east-southeast. Here's your outlook for the rest of the day. Through this week, 81 today, 83 tomorrow. A couple of scattered storms possible uh, tomorrow. Better chance uh, on Wednesday. As that front moves through 85 in advance of that front, then about 10 or 11 degrees cooler on Thursday behind the front, and then sunny and cool on Friday. Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer has your next complete look at the forecast coming up this evening, beginning at 5 on CBS 4 News. Have a great afternoon.